All right, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV. I am your host, Tragic Life, and we are... We have made it back into the Tower of Babel, and we're going down, or up, down, down, because we're trying to get back to the Underworld. Uh, we picked up a new character. Um, he's a ninja, Edge. And we're we're moving forward. Let's continue. So, I think... That was two core coral orals and a mat over. We're going to go through here. This should take us to B4, which... I mean, that was kind of obvious, right? All right. Head all the way south. Okay, so apparently the corals can be dangerous. I'm, I'm fight off, off screen. I am fighting, honestly. I'm fighting with um, auto, so I'm not getting a lot of actual fighting in. Um, I find it to be a little bit faster, so bear with me, okay? All right. I think we're going to pass this bridge. Let me double check. Yeah. Knowing the first bridge, and then we're going to go up the second bridge. That's not the second bridge. For uh, $82,000. I want to find $82,000. Shoot, I'll, I'll, I'll settle for 82000 quarters. All right, anyway, uh, dimes might be good too. Eight thousand dollars, I think, right? I, I can do math. Some of y'all can probably do it better than me. Uh, I might do eighty two thousand nickels. I don't know. I should do the math on that. Let me double check real quick. Let's see. Am I stupid? I'm not great at math. I'm gonna be honest. We're gonna go ahead and pull the calculator up because I'm just I threw a thought in my head and now I gotta know. You know what I mean? Okay, yeah, yeah, I'll take it as quarters. That's $20,000. Yeah, I'll take that. Uh, let's try dimes, we said, right? That's, yeah, I had that $88,000. $88, so nickels could be forty one. What about pennies? I mean, even pennies, I'll take it in pennies because apparently that's $820. Um,. Man, my mouth is my math is terrible. Anyway, I was just curious. I mean, eight, you know what I mean? I'll take it. Okay, so when you're ready, quit both Cecil and Kane with the ice brand. So let's go ahead and up. Oh, you want me to all right. ice brand? And ice brand and ice lance. Excuse me. Oh. So we're gonna go up this bridge here, and we're gonna get into some stuff. Edge, father, mother. Thank heavens you are all right. You're alive. Come with us, Edge. Yes, come with us. Where? Do well. Well, okay. So, King of Eglon and Queen of Eblon. This is... Oh, I've got an auto. I'm sorry. Um, this shouldn't be too hard. There's, he doesn't give me any, like, special things I need to do. You know what I mean? So let's see, we have Shadow Bomb. Pin the target, temporarily prevents it from performing any action. Let's try that. I don't know what just happened. Shadow Blind, Shadow Bind. It did not work. He's got some life. Ah, you can still. I stole a potion. It's me, Edge, your son.
What the heck is going on? The king and queen break free. I'm not reading. I was actually reading on how to fight the next boss. I'm sorry, Edge. As we keep beating the crap out of Dad. We must go now. Elbin Eblon lies in good hands. I mean, I feel like if we were actually fighting this, we we we're doing pretty well. Serve our people well. Can you quit talk faster, man? Don't go. Maybe I should just sit here. I don't know. Oh, I killed him. Farewell, my son. Mother! Don't go. And she went. <laughs> Edge. Look, hey, how dare he? Rubicante, you sick bastard! It was Luge who turned your parents into monsters. I am sorry for your loss. My only wish is to battle you fairly. To hell with your self-righteous blabbering. I admire your spirit, but anger never bears true strength that it blinds you from what you truly need to see. Shut up, I'll show you the power of rage. Anger evoked Edge's dormant powers. Edge has learned Flood and Blitz. Well, this is interesting. Still, nothing can penetrate my cloak of flame, not even ice. All right, so don't heal. Don't use your potions, nothing. Talk to him. I shall restore you to full strength. Do not disappoint me. He actually wants a fair fight. Um, although it's not really fair. We'll get into that in a second. So let me pause this because there is a lot of information. All right, so let me start with the fact that when his cloak is closed like it is currently do not attack or uh don't use magic just attack normally uh, because it will heal him okay so he hits pretty hard from my understanding okay i need to turn off auto before i die um he has 34,000 life. So there's some stuff we can do here. We're going to start doing it now that I have now that he's no longer hiding behind his cape. Okay, so Ridia is going to summon Shiva. Okay? Constantly. That's what she's going to do constantly. Um we're going to use Kiraga constantly with him. We're going to attack normally or we can actually jump with Kane. Um, with him, we're going to go ahead and use Flood until he dies. And that's, and we're just going to keep doing that over and over. Once Edge runs out of magic or MP, we can switch to normal attack. He 
he has a move called Inferno that is lethal. Okay, I like Flood. I mean, we're putting some good pain on him, and we hit hard. His magic isn't that effective. Yet. I'm sure to get better. So let's go ahead and jump, because I'm just curious. This is the one. Okay, that's the dangerous one. So as soon as he's knocked down, go ahead and raise him and then hit him with a cure. Oh, crap. We're going to heal him. Shoot. That wasn't that bad. See? You heal him. So now we're just going to attack. And buff. We're gonna buff. We're gonna buff. Please don't miss. Hit everybody. Perfect. Okay. Should do even less damage now. No. Okay, white magic, we're going to go ahead and blink. Can we blink everyone? We cannot, so we're going to go ahead and Kiraga everybody. So he has a lot of life. That's his biggest problem, honestly, is that he's got a lot of life. So we're gonna keep doing what we're doing because I mean we're 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 hitting him harder than I think we've hit anyone so far. He really likes his fire, doesn't he? Okay, so Edge is problematic and radiant because they don't have a lot of life. So we're gonna go ahead. And do nothing. Okay, we won. Hey! That wasn't too bad. Even the weak become strong when they gather. I am most impressed until we meet again. That was fun. That was actually a pretty good fight. Father, mother, you can rest in peace now. Young Highness? Who the hell are you? Old man! Seneschal. Pray, let us fight with you. Where is the dead devil Rubicot? We beat him. We got him. It's over. Amazing, your Young Highness. These guys helped me out. So who's this Gobez? Rubicon's master. He plans to gather the crystal to reach the moon. Why the moon? I mean, that's the question. We don't know exactly. He seeks some great power there. We have to stop him. So he's the mastermind behind all this. That I'm going with you. He didn't say then, but you get it. But your young highness, Eblon, needs you. That can wait. We've got to stop this guy before it's too late. But... Uh, stop worrying and go home. I'll be fine. Very well. Everyone, please take good care of our prince. Good fortune, your highness. Thank you, everyone. Okay. Excuse me. Okay, let's go get Gobez. We need to get the crystals first. Right, right. Either way. There's only one way to go, so we're going to go this way. It's a trap! Dang it. I 
Ow! That hurt. That was a nasty drop. What do you got here? High potion. Okay, well that was a little shocking. I wasn't expecting that. I should have expected that, but okay. Oh, we got a Mithril Golem. Mmm. And they came up behind us, which is terrible. I don't like these guys because they cast Bile, which can be dangerous. And our weakest characters are non... are in the front. Quit bioing us! Okay. I need edge. I thought so. So bio is a counterattack for the ghost knights. I can't stand the ghost knights either. So we're going to go ahead and jump on you. You're going to use... We haven't used Blitz yet, so let's see what Blitz does. White Magic Cura. I mean, that was cool, I guess. Oh, crap. Oh, that was vicious! Bro! What? That was rude, man. All right. All right, let's continue. Sheesh. Okay, there's not a lot of paths. Well, there's not a lot to get here, so... Okay, so hold on. Uh, bottom head east. All right, that was a coral. Two corals and an anima. One of those anima thingies. Ooh. So we have a Lamia Mart Matriarch. And a Mystery Egg. Be careful of the Mystery Egg. Okay, it's just a Lamia. They can they can make dragons, so that's a problem. Alright, that was fun. Edge gained a level. Oh, we missed a high potion. An enemy airship. Alright, we can escape in this. But it's an enemy ship. Who cares? I'm sure she'd rather be flown by us. Yeah, we missed a potion. Um, don't don't suppose this could be a trap, do you? This beauty, not a chance. Let's call her Falcon. What do you think, Rydia? Shoots me fine. Let's get going. Yes, let's go. Falcon, take us up. So yeah, there was a potion in there I missed. Oops. Okay, so we're gonna go southeast. Back to where are we going? We're going to do, 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 Dwarven Castle. So we can't fly over the lava. That's strange, but we'll go with it. Hey, I kind of remember this area. Yeah. Okay, make our way to the throne room. Giot, you've returned! Were you able to recover the crystals? I'm sorry. I see, Gobez is very persistent. He is trying to open the sealed cave by force. I don't know what that is. It will be a matter of time before he succeeds, though. Please, get the crystal before he does. Luca, come here. Yes. Your necklace. Here. This is the key to open the sealed cave. Without this necklace, no one can enter. We must protect the last crystal. 
we'll do our best. Lucas. Of course, I can't put it on because I got something I don't want. Let's see. I really need to find a... I absolutely need to find a... fat chocobo so I can drop some stuff off. All right, is that all I'm doing here? Which is the key? See, okay, blah, 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 blah. Leave the throne room via the western stairs, then head down the stairs. Talk to the person in the... Okay, so leave the throne room and exit via the western stairs. Okay, leave the throne room, so all the way up, and then go to the western stairs. Okay, what are we doing? Then head down the stairs besides the inn. Okay. We should be in B1. We are. Then go then to the infirmary. Is this the infirmary? Okay. Uh, what are we doing here? Talk to the person in the bed in the upper left of the infirmary, and you'll gain the ability to fly over lava. Hey, where's my food? Sid! I can't believe it. How did you... <laughs> Who's this geezer? Hey, watch your mouth. Geezer? Who's this snot-nosed kid? Watch your mouth, windbag. I'm Edge, Prince of Evelyn. It's hard to believe, but it's true. I'm also handsome and really skilled. Okay, a little vain. <sighs> Sid needs a rest. I'll listen to you brag. <laughs> really have got you whipped, eh, kid? Shut up, geez. So what a Gobes. He still holds something. We can't go after the last crystal since we left the Enterprise on the surface. We've taken an enemy airship, but it can't fly with a magma around here. I guess it's time for me to shine. You're all just hopeless without me. Back to bed. Wait till you heal. Ah, Canada didn't give me a hand. I think he's fine, yeah. Okay. Thank you, Sid. Sid? He must be pooped. He's overworked himself again. Thank you, Sid. Okay, I think this is a perfect time to leave you and get ready for the next video so um i'm seeing a little secret here i'm gonna try to set this up and see if i can get it working if i can get it working i will show you a really cool trick to steal a lot of sirens um yeah we'll figure out how this works uh we got a lot of side stuff to do now um so until next time adios amigos